In this session, I will cover a new feature in PowerPoint 2016, that of design ideas. So if we go here to the design tab, and we have a presentation that we were working on earlier, we have uh, slides with various content in it and such. And all that you have to do is basically, you can change the design or you can have the software here, PowerPoint 2016, give you ideas on the design for this slide. So all that you'd have to do is basically click on the slide that you want to change the design for it, and then click on design ideas. For certain slides, depending on the content and such, because we don't have many objects in it, it may not give you any ideas. However, if you go on another one, for example, creating an outline, here we have three steps for it. Notice design ideas, it presents us with a bunch of options that we can simply click on it and it will apply it to our slide. It will change the whole design for our slide. So instead of you spending all afternoon designing this and not making it so color coordinated and such, you're basically just simply using one of those existing designs from here. Here you'd basically go to the next slide as well and then click on design ideas and notice it's giving us similar designs here as well. So we could simply click on this option or that or either one of those that makes our presentation more versatile. If I go here and insert a new slide and then I want an image that I copied from the web and such, notice as soon as I inserted the image here, it gives me additional ideas. So now notice, for example, on this one, it's most of a slide here, it's going to be this picture and then some area here to insert content. Or we can go here to different other designs that might work best for this scenario. So that's a very cool feature in PowerPoint 2016. It may not work on every one of your slides. However, my suggestion would be is that you go to each slide or typical slides in your presentation and then uh, try as to what suggestions PowerPoint 2016 has for your presentation or for your slide. So now next we are going to learn about how to import slides from a different presentation into our existing presentation.